be talking about the uh, main uh, display here of the Pool Warden. Some of these features will also um, be available on the Mini Warden, which we'll go over separately. But uh, as you can see, this Pool Warden is set up for a DPD sensor with the True DPD accessory. So we have a PPM or a PPH temperature and flow. Now this is also a two pool configuration. If you only have one pool, then you'd only see uh, one line of data here. And also at the bottom of the screen, it says relay, pool one, and then pool two over here. And this will actually show you the status of the relays. The, what the, the underlines, that means that the, uh, the relay is off. If you have an up, hour, up arrow, that is, uh, means the relay is feeding. If there's a down arrow, that means that it's in its uh, weight or mixing cycle. Also, if you see C and O in any one of these spots here, like um, this would be this would be your ORP, this would be your pH on pool one, and ORP and pH on pool two. But if there's an O here instead of uh, the line or the arrows, that means it has gone into overfeed. And it will not uh, function anymore until that overfeed is reset. Also, um, you notice down here in the corner, there is an N. That's for uh, units uh, uh, configured to uh, connect to the internet. N means not connected. C would be connected. Also here on flow, of course, this is they're they're both off uh, because uh, this is a demo unit. But normally these are read on, meaning that there is uh, flow through the bypass and it will allow it to feed chemicals if this if this says off it cannot feed chemical but next to this you have an a for which is for alarm now to if you want to find out what the alarm situation is push the right arrow and that will give you in this case says on if ph is greater than 8.0 on pool one and also on pool two. So whatever the alarm situation is, that's an easy way to ex access that. Okay, now some of the um, the quick uh, uh, menu features here. If we press the number nine, we'll get our set points. In this case, it'd be 2.0 ppm or P700 pH75. Now, again, re remember if you do not have the true DVD sensor installed on this controller, you will not get the ppm readings. And go back to the main screen. Uh, another <coughs> handy feature here is once your pool warden's set up and you want to just tweak it a little bit you can actually go in here and press number two and that will give you a quick setup which just gives you your very basic um, measurements or, or um, values where you can go here to on if ORP push enter and you can change that to any number you want say we want to go to 720 and then push enter and then it'll also allow us to to tweak our on and off times so you can get real precise on your chemical control which will help uh, alleviate uh, wasting of chemicals with um, with our controllers you can effectively um, Get your set points um, real tight, and typically, like on ORP, you can achieve a plus or minus 10 millivolt reading at any given time, 
and a 0.1 on your pH. Again, that is if it's set up correctly, which that just requires a little bit of uh, time to watch it and see how it reacts. It depends a lot on how many gallons you have and the output of your pump. So whether you have an extreme high output pump or or not, you can actually program this to keep a, a real narrow range on, on your chemical dispensing, um, even if you're going to, say, a spa.